I had a coach in Slovakia that we couldn't talk, but he had me going. Like I was the only pro on the team that was international. So I had to go in for an extra practice to like meet my contract. And mm -hmm. some, one of the most consistent things that he had me do, which I've definitely carried over to the beach is he would put up a, a rubber band, like a, from the top of the antenna on one side to the top of the antenna on the other side. Yes. And I wasn't allowed to leave practice until I hit my serve through that band, like through the, between the net and that band and then landing in the back three feet of the court. Um, and I had to do it like, 10 times or something like that. Um, but I think especially if you can create that visual, something that I'll, I'll say to a lot of beginners or intermediates who are having trouble with this is if you can draw that line at the top of the antenna to the other antenna and create a pretty much another box above the net, act like it's filled with glass and it's your job to break that glass. Ooh, I like um, that. I think, if we can break that glass, then you're going to be surprised on the amount of serves that you're able to miss deep. Um, if you do miss a serve deep, it's probably because you hit it above that glass. Mm -hmm. um, but if you're able to hit that zone and it, if, if it's hard and it's flat and it's a float serve, um, <laughs> then it's, it's, it's going to be like probably the best serve that you have the ability to do. It's going to help you with strength and it's going to make that passer have to react quickly. So I think yeah. that, that that visual helps a lot with a lot of players I've worked with. I love that. To break that, that pane of glass, uh, I'm going to steal that. That's good. Steal away.